Hey guys, we are back. What is up? Thank you for tuning into this episode of Hooked on OC. Every Sunday morning we're here. And maybe every Sunday morning I'm here. I'm on the corner of Route 50 and 589 at Crabs to Go. No, I'll say it again. I am not part owner of the place, but the man directly to my right is Dan Parker. I missed you, buddy. I missed you, buddy. Great seeing you, man. Great seeing you. He knows I'm a hugger. Hello. And Riley, welcome again. You did a great job. Did a great job in our segments. And she's only been here for two months. So the fact she's out here doing segments with us is a real testimony to the staff they have inside working this stuff she knows it already she's a pro and they trust her with segments <laughs> that's all a great thing so you guys know i'm in here getting crabs corn and stuff all summer long it's all going really really well right now dan is the specialist with this stuff 30 how many years 40 something what 45, 45 years <laughs> on the corner here for 30 plus though right <laughs> I do. He's been in the business for most of my life, yeah. uh, and that's why he's really, really good at it. And you know, you don't have anything to worry about here at Crabs to Go because it's underneath his supervision. Um, but you guys got some really great product in right now, man. So what happens over on the steamer, man? You guys, we had Kristen had lobster tail the other night. You got you got four and like eight to ten ounce lobster tails available. Yeah, right. King and snow crab legs, obviously. Right. Look at these. Talk about these bad boys. Uh, right now, the bulk of our crabs are coming out of Maryland. We're still getting a few from down south, uh, which is necessary. Maryland goes uh, has their ups and downs where they're yep. catching more here and, and there. Yep. Uh, right. but, uh, it's worth uh, the wait, though. Uh, but anywhere, Chop Tank River West, Chop Tank River, Chester River, Y River, and Miles River. I mean, awesome. Those are, uh, those are four rivers that we deal with. And, and those are the best. I mean, uh, well, you hear about, best. You hear about crabs like, around the world. That's yeah. where you hear. Yeah. That's uh, yeah. <laughs> it, uh, well, that's true. I mean, you get a good yellow mustard out of yep. them. Very, very sweet. Uh, really heavy, yep. tasty. I mean, it's uh, there are uh, there are different crabs around, but uh, but I mean, when you want to deal with the bass, I mean, that's, that's what you got to go. That's to. Maryland crabs. Yep. Man. You hear about it all up and down the coast. Yep. And like I say, anybody anybody gets them shipped around the world, they they, they love them too. It's Maryland crabs are are the kind of the top of the echelon as far as crabs go. Um, and you guys, but you guys also do really good with king and snow crab legs, and these are delicious. Right? Some by the pound and more and more and more popular. Yeah, yeah. It, it's uh, uh, I guess the price point on them, uh, price point. It, it is a relatively, as seafood goes, it's a rel relatively inexpensive yeah. mm -hmm. option. Yep. Yeah. And you're getting a real delicacy. You know, yeah. because oh, right. it's, yeah. you know, yep. and uh, honestly, between crabs for, from you know, blue crabs and king crab legs, you seem like you get a little bit bigger, better yield because the legs are so full, they're not as hard to pick. The body's already taken care of for you. Right. So, you know, you're getting into an adventure here when you pick blue crabs from Maryland, right. but you know how to bust these claws on a snow crab leg. <laughs> you can get some really good yield and get those nice yeah. big bites of that white pink meat, man. It's delicious. Um, if I sure. sound like I know what I'm talking about, it's because I do. Yeah, I, I, had them last week. I had them last week and they're fantastic. <laughs> uh, they're absolutely fantastic. And the corn, we've stopped going to the grocery store because yeah. your corn is just the best in the area. It really is. Right. It's uh, it is starting to get local, finally. Okay. So yeah. you're even getting it from guys right here. Uh, right. Yes. Yes. Even better. Yes. Even better. Yeah. yeah, absolutely awesome. Grab some butter from here, a couple packets of salt, smother that thing and devour it. They'll steam it right here for you. Um, and then Riley, here's some of the staples from the restaurant. I've, I've had all this stuff within the past <laughs> month or so, except for the rockfish bites, but you yeah. guys do a huge flounder sandwich. My, one of my sons and myself, our favorite is the crab, crab pretzel. pretzel. Clam strips to die for, crab cakes are awesome. Tell me about this stuff. Yeah, so we just have so much good fried food. You can yeah. also get some of it broiled. Your crab cakes are like uh, fish fillets. You can get them broiled okay, if you good. don't want them fried. Yep. Um, all of our sandwiches come with a pickle, lettuce, tomato, and coleslaw. You can trade them out for sides if you want. Okay, but, that's good. Uh, typically, that's what they come with. Yep. And then we have baskets too that are all fried: uh, clam strip baskets, oyster baskets, shrimp baskets. Um, they all come with uh, French fries as the side, and it's really good just to munch on some seafood. That's yeah. awesome. And Dan, these are—I think you told me these are your grandma's recipes, or your mom's recipes, or something. Somebody's no, uh, no, they're you not. lied to me. Or <laughs> yeah, yeah, I that lied up? to you, Scott. Look at this, guys. He just so admitted, he admitted that he lied to me, but I, whatever, <laughs> it worked it's on me. Good. They're delicious. Our suits are fantastic. I mean, it, it's, I mean, people come over and over and over. I mean, we see the uh, same guy uh, probably two or three times a week. Yeah. Uh, like in the cream of crab soup. This I mean, is that's, Maryland crab soup's awesome also, uh, but the cream of crab soup is very special. It's yeah. awesome. And we'll find that inside with the rest of the stuff. Awesome spot out here in what I call the boat yard to have a place to eat. <laughs> but all the magic happens inside. Ta-da! He takes his bow. And Dan says that's not even a jumbo. This is the kind of crabs you're going to find in Crabs to Go, guys. They steam them up right here. And don't forget the case. Smith Island cakes, all your soups and salad made fresh daily. Fresh fish, oysters by the dozen, clams, corn, 
you name it, they got it. Come see them here on the corner, Route 50 and 589, 410, 641, 5, what? 9379. 9379. Come see them, guys.